distinguished chief guest of today's function, Honorable Vice President of Republic of India, Dr. Muhammad Hamid Ansari Saab, the Education Minister of Maharashtra, a friend of Anjuman, Mr. Vinod Taudeji, friend of Anjuman of Have Nots, friend of Have Nots, Sudinder Kulkarni Saab, Chairman of ORF, Vice Chancellor of this great University of Mumbai. This university, from where I have graduated and post graduated in medicine, I'm proud of it. In pre independent India, there were three universities University of Calcutta, Chennai, and Mumbai. And Mumbai stood out all these years. It's a great privilege and honor for me to say a few words. Today, a book is being released of the speeches by the stalwarts of the Freedom Movement of India, named as August Voices. And it is so relevant to me and my institution, Anjuman Islam, which is about 143 year old with one like 10,000 students and about a dozen institutes attached to this university. The founding fathers of Anjuman were the freedom fighters. They were the one who opposed Jinnah's concept, Muhammad Ali Jinnah's concept of two-nation theory. Some of our members of Anjuman were in jail for years. Honorable Vice President Saab, you knew Mr. late Moinuddin Harris, who was the president of Anjuman and has been in jail for 10 years, also part of movement of Sayyid Maharashtra movement. We have n number of stalwarts. One gentleman by name, Mr. Subani, after whom a hostel is named for Anjuman Islam, he offered a blank check to Mahatma Gandhi, him take my contribution for the freedom struggle. He was a big textile tycoon. He burnt out all his textile. <laughs> this is the contribution which Anjuman has done for the freedom struggle. It is so appropriate today. A book of that era is being published and released today. ORF, Observer Research Foundation, has done immense service in the last 26 years. And the man who heads it is none other than Mr. Sudhinder Kulkarni, who is a friend of everyone. In a country like ours, multilinguistic, multireligious, and it values ethos of secularism. He is a shining example. His research is not based in classroom or auditoriums or conferences. His research is to the lowest person who deserves what he needs to have. Great work, Sudhinder Kulkarni Sahib, in the field of education, in the, in the field of health, and rural upliftment of the countrymen. I congratulate you for your great services. And the Honorable Vice President, I believe, was a distinguished fellow of ORF about 20 years ago. Anjuman and ORF, they are like two siblings. We will try and contribute in as many ways as we can. The other day, we had distinguished education minister of, in, of Maharashtra, who said that the contribution which Anjuman does in producing citizenry of India in the field of education, be it in technology and otherwise, is commendable. This is our contribution. We'll continue to do so, and I wish Sudinder Kulkarni Saab, the very best. Thank you very much for giving patience hearing.